They've never tangled before somehow, some way, and now it's time for these two behemoths to go to war. So much power, even the heavyweight fighter. Really mixing it up oh, here. He was, got was that a punch or a slip? I don't know. It looks like he may have been hit there, and we'll see that in the replay. But now, Krunewald is swarming, and Potts is on his back. That is not where he wants to be. He can't operate. Big shots by Brandon Krunewald. Potts is covering up. He's in trouble here, Cyrus. Oh, he is eating some big-time shots. Looks to set up the triangle as Potts now. It's going to swing over for the armbar, most likely from here. He's trying to get the wrist control, trying to recoup and recover. Krunewald oh, he's is getting landing a shots. Few shots. He's going to have to move, Dirk. Krunewald is landing hammer fist like an angry child here. Big shots by Brendan Grunewald. Now switching position. Passes quite easily. Still in the half guard, though. This is where he worked from successfully so far. A minute 40 remains in the first round. Potts is in big trouble with a minute remaining. Grunewald is looking to finish here, trying to pass. Now he does. Inside control. Not in a good place, but that's going to give Ruan the opening he's that he needed. He's got the guillotine. And he's yanked it down on it, and he's finished many people before. He's got the same Cyrus. This has to be it. Potts is holding, squeezing, squeezing. I don't think he has the position. Does he have the position? No. Pot, no, Grunewald's going to get out of oh, this. Oh, he pops out. Brennan Grunewald fights another day. And is this going to kill the composure of Ruan Potts? He thought he may have had that finish. We've seen that before. If he can't take you out, he wants to get to the end of this round, Dirk, badly. He has 30 seconds to go, and that's going to seem like an hook. hour. He's going for the heel hook, and he's done it before. Yanking on the leg. If he doesn't get this submission, this is going to be so deflating for one pot. Seconds remain. Potts has got this locked in deep. Can he tap him? We can't see the face. Kurnavalt's not even flinching. He looks, he oh. looks like he's okay. But now Potts he is. is. Wrenching though. Seconds remaining. No. Kurnavalt just Kurnavalt looking just up at the referee saying, What's up? Wow. If anything, it got him to the end of the round, Dirk. And that, that's the thing about Potts. Usually after that first round, it's very interesting to see what he can do. Oh, and a Whoa. big, big punches by oh, Ron Potts. Jab again and again and again. Grunewald's now in trouble. Potts looking to finish. What a jab. And he pulls the guillotine. Oh, oh, he slips off. And he slips off. Grunewald's in mount. Potts desperately looking for the sweep. Oh, he tried so hard to get oh. that sweep. <laughs> he yanked on that guillotine, but it was not to oh, happen. No. Potts now looking to sweep, and he successfully gets Brendan off of him, and he gets oh, the mount. Oh, an amazing sweep. Potts has the mount. Wow. <laughs> Ruan Potts putting on a game performance, one of the best performances we've seen out of him in a while. Digging deep now is Ruan Potts. Now what does he have left? Because I'll tell you, Brendan Krunovald is spent right now. Both men extremely tired. Done. Who has enough left in the tank to finish this fight? A nice left. Oh, now he's going to give up his back, and that's a bad thing to that, do with Ruan Potts. He's going to look for that rear naked. Grunewald is flattened out completely. Look at the face of Ruan Potts. The, the, how much he is straining to finish this fight. If he could just land those shots, those hooks are in, and he's flattening them out. And he's got that one arm. Doesn't look like he's got it under the Thumbs chin. Thumbs up by Brendan Grunewald. You can see from this position, he's actually got his chin tucked. He's not underneath the arm of Potts, but he is flattened out completely. He has to watch out for fingers in his face and in his eyes. Ferdy oh, Basson right at the top there. of the action. He's under there. Gets he it. taps. Ruan Potts does it again. He's not done yet, ladies and gentlemen. Fangs is still very much a contender. Dirk, is he going to make another run? He's he awful said, close. He said he wanted to. He gets two big <laughs> victories. This time over a former champion. Do we wow. see Andrew von Salen and Ruan Potts fight again? Is that even possible? Four, yes. It will be if it does happen. Of course, you still have Elvis Boyo in the mix. Of course, you, you still have many, Bethel Mostert as well. Many contenders in the heavyweight division right now. But for a night, we saw Ruan <laughs> Potts. Wow. This looked like Ruan Potts from three or four years ago, being able to weather the storm win the fight, get the sweep, and victorious on the night. Let's take a look at our Super Crush action replay. Well, that's the first jab, rung the bell, and again, and again, and again, and again, God, and again, run six, Potts. seven, eight unanswered shots, and then he just tried to finish with the guillotine, slipped off, brings it to the ground, and that was all she wrote. He fought with the ground and pound to get underneath the chin, and he got it.
another submission victory. What a win. Ruan Potts does it again, folks. Just when you start counting him out, thinking he's done with his career, another big win for Fangs. Your Super Crush action replay leading crushing and mining contractors. Let's send it to Shane to Duke Wellington for our official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ferdy Basson has called a stop to this contest four minutes and 21 seconds into the second round, declaring the winner by tap out due to a rear naked choke, Ruan Fangs Potts. To be able to win a Ruan Potts run, you had to really, really dig deep in that second round. I just want to say praise the Lord. Thank you so much. If it wasn't for him guiding me to our team at HOT, House of Tinkerbell, JP, Saki and Conan, guys, thank you. And all team of hot. Thanks, guys. Well, you were in big trouble in that second round. You started off really good landing. I think it was about seven or eight jabs, solid on the mark. But as soon as it went down to the ground and he had that top position, how deep did you have to dig to actually get that reversal? I tell you, after the second round came, my legs were a bit jelly. I so I couldn't even flip him or anything. But guys, please raise your hands. Give a big round of applause to this guy. What a machine, eh? What a machine. Let him say something quick. Well, an, incredible, an incredible performance by you, Ruan. We look forward to seeing you inside the hexagon again. Great victory. Chat to Brenda Grunewald quickly. Uh, guys, thank you so much for coming to support us. Keep supporting the sport. I'll honestly say that tonight's my official goodbye. Uh, I love competing. I love competing in Cape Town. Thanks to everybody. It's like 12, 13 trots down. I'm done. Thanks for the good ride. Came as a bit of a surprise. Looking back at your career now, what's the moments that stood out for you? Um, I don't think there's anything that really stood out. I think every single moment has been special and precious. Um, I've really loved it. Uh, it's an awesome sport, awesome community, awesome family. Um, no highlights, eh? just the opportunity to compete. I'm blessed. Well, congratulations on a great career and all the best for the future. Brendan Grunewald, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, so much happens there in just a few minutes. Of course, the very victorious Ruan Potts and then the retirement right here. Brendan Grunewald here in Cape Town among his hometown. He retires after an incredible run in the sport and a heavyweight championship. Very impressive. Alpha Cam SA, our industry leading television broadcast professionals and proud broadcast suppliers to the extreme fighting championship our co-main event coming up after this more from cape town south africa